Hey guys, here's step six of building your own website. For this step, you're going to start blogging on your class website. This will be the majority of the content that ends up appearing there and will help make it start to feel like a real place. As a reminder, WordPress has two types of content, pages and posts. Pages tend to be static content, which doesn't change very often, something like your about page, and posts behave like any social media feed. They have a date and time stamp when they are published and then they're viewed in reverse chronological order. So start by logging onto your class website. Once you're on the dashboard, instead of clicking on pages, click on posts. Your blog will probably have a hello world post that was published automatically when you set it up. Go ahead and trash that. And then click add new. Now you're back in the familiar WordPress editing interface. In fact, there's absolutely no difference between the interface for posts and pages. So you just have to make sure you're choosing the right one. Go ahead and write a title and then get blogging. Now the blogging assignment asks you to write posts that are at least 250 words. You can do that by copying and pasting this into Word and using the word count, but it turns out WordPress actually has this feature built in under these little lines. And then if you click outline, it will tell you how many words you've written so far. Once you're finally done, click publish on the post. You'll be asked to double check that you like the settings. Click publish again, and then you can double check by viewing your post. And that's it. Step six is done. You have created your first blog post.